Today I have a quick video for you to show you what you can make with my new free downloadable printable which is available on my website. If you watch to the end I will be giving you a password which will give you free access to my download page and at the moment there are three designs on there that you can download and there will be more coming in the future. And this is the third design in the series. So let's jump in and I will show you how I made those bottle cap charms. You are going to need some glossy accents. That's the best glue that I have found to stick the glass cabochons onto the designs. And these are the one inch glass domes or cabochons that you will need. And these magnify the design and make them look really pretty. But you may decide that you want to use resin domes which are a lot slimmer. And these ones are sticky backed and you don't need to use the glossy accents if you use the one inch resin domes. You'll also need these bottle caps which you can get in various colours and are also in my Amazon shops in various colours and you must make sure that you get the craft bottle caps and not the ones for beer making because the ones for beer making have plastic liners in them and they're a real nuisance to you so avoid them and you might want to get some Gorilla Glue because this stuff is really good and your designs will stick inside the bottle caps forever. <laughs> you also need some 9mm split rings. I've got black and silver here. And a selection of charms if you want to hang charms from the bottom of your bottle caps. And you're going to need a hammer and some scissors. And you will need these punch pliers that will make a 1.8 millimeter hole in your in the edge of your bottle cap and that's so that you can put your split rings onto the bottle cap and a one inch circular craft punch would be good you can use scissors if you want to but it's much much quicker and neater if you use um, a craft punch and if you can't get hold of any of these supplies um, you can go on to my Amazon shops in both the US and the UK and get mostly everything that you see here. But I do urge people to please try and get everything you can from your local craft sorry from your local craft shops because otherwise they are going to close down. So this is the free design, the latest one, and as I said, you will need the password to get onto the page on my website where my free downloads are. And that will come at the end of this video. So just follow along here with what I'm doing. You either cut these circles out by hand with scissors, or if you have a one inch circular punch, you need to take the bottom off so that you can turn it upside down and line the circles up properly. Now this is one inch glass cabochon and this is the glossy accents and you only need a tiny little blob in the middle of the design. Just like that. No more. Because you don't want it to squish out the edges. You want just enough to go all the way to the edges. And there, look at that, it's crystal clear. I haven't had much success with other glues and I do love glossy accents. Now this is me putting on the one inch resin dome. They can be a bit tricky to put on. I don't think I got that one on quite straight. And I think, oh no, was it that one? There was one of these that I didn't, I got it on a bit kind of skew whiffy. <laughs> and, but it's okay, It you know. It didn't really show. So next you need to put some of the Gorilla Glue into... Oh no, 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 no. I've jumped the gun there. See these edges, these fluted edges? Well, they need to be 
turned over with a hammer. Before you do that, you need to use your 1.8 millimeter punch, punch pliers, to make a tiny neat little hole. And I put mine in the top and the bottom of the um, bottle cap. And then you need to do what I do here. So you tap, 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 tap all around the edge. You can see that. And it turns that edge over to give it a much neater look, if you can see that. Now you can get these already, already flattened, as they call it, like these ones here that I have. The only thing that I don't like about these is, unless you can find some that have already got the hole in, I just find these a bit, not difficult to put the hole in, but it shut they just the hole kind of bends the because you can see here there's a couple that I did after I flattened it's just personal choice really so then I put my split rings on and I've chosen to put two split rings top and bottom then you use your Gorilla Glue oh there's your password just for you capital J capital F capital Y so remember that and then I will give you instructions at the end on how to use it. So you stick a blob of Gorilla Glue in each bottle cap, spread it around a bit, and then very carefully lay your designs, and which are already attached to the either the glass cabochon or the resin domes. And this is what they look like. I've attached my charms with the split rings, and I've attached some keychains here. And they're absolutely gorgeous. I love them. So I hope you have enjoyed this. Subscribe if you want to see more. This is my channel. Lots of crafty videos on there. And please leave a comment and let me know how you got... If, if you make these, how did you get on? Okay, so the password again, just for you, capital J, capital F, capital Y, all one word, but with the capitals. So when you get onto that page, this is what you're going to see. So obviously you just put your password in there and hit enter, and then you will see this. And by the time you go onto that page, the link will be live. It's not live at the moment, which is why it's in red. But by the time this video is published and the blog post is published, that link will be live. So it's as easy as that. And once you get onto that page, you will be able to download any of the designs that are on there. I will be adding more as time goes on. And... There are instructions, brief instructions on there, how to use the prints. They are always 6x4. I advise you to print them onto glossy paper. Well, thank you for watching, and I hope that you will come back soon. I've got lots more videos lined up for you, and I will be pleased to see you here. Take care. Bye.